I'm going to show you some basic calculations with the standard uh, GED calculator um, based on this sheet right here. Now in order to get the square root of 64, what you'll do is you'll enter 64 and then you'll go up here and press the shift button and then you'll press this button which is the X2. You'll get 8. Okay, the next calculation is 64 squared. Now, it requires the same buttons except for that shift button. So what you'll do is you'll enter 64 and then you'll hit this button. You'll get that number. Okay, and then we'll do some fractions. Uh, I have one right here. And how you'll enter the fractions is like this. First you'll clear that. Then you'll enter 3. This button right here is the ABC button. Fourths. Then you'll add 2, the ABC button. Thirds. And that will be your answer. 1 and 5 twelfths, which I wrote down over here. It's just in a different way because, of course, the calculator can't stack it up. Okay, then we'll enter this one. Now, this is a negative number. And how you'll do that is you'll clear this. And then you'll enter this. I'll show you. 9. Okay, and this button right here, which is the plus minus sign, then you add, then 2. And that will give you your answer of negative 7. Now, there are several different calculations. Uh, of course, there are several different problems that you can do with this calculator. Um, but those are some basic ones. Uh, you can also do percents with this calculator. Um, just be sure that whenever you're entering your calculations, um, you know, be sure that you follow uh, pretty much that basic route that I gave you. And you should be okay. All right.